Finding good quality medieval reenactment equipment can be really hard these days. There aren't a whole lot of shops in Australia and buying online can be so hit and miss. I know from personal experience how tempting it can be to go for cheaper stuff and sometimes you get very disappointed with the product. So why would someone go on crusade? Well, the medieval period was an incredibly different time to what we experience today. Many medieval people were well traveled. Many had been on pilgrimage, maybe within their local uh, countries uh, to some of the bigger monasteries and the abbeys and some of those kind of sites and to the, the, the places and centers of religion within their, their country. But many people had also uh, gone on to pilgrimage into the Holy Land itself. So there would have been stories flooding back home about the persecution of the Christian pilgrims and there was an acute awareness within the Christian church of the, the Muslim rapid expansion that had occurred in the eastern part of, if you like, the Christian sort of world. So I believe very strongly that the Christian people of the day felt uh, moral and ethical obligations to go and assist people um, that they felt were in distress and they felt needed their help and so uh, this is one of the big motivations for going on crusade and the um, and the Pope had said during the Council of Claremont that if you go on to crusade that sins can be forgiven. Right there I believe that we can see some of the very big motivations behind it. I understand that today people tend to view Christian uh, people tend to view religion much more skeptically uh, and, and much more sort of uh, it's, it's not as big a deal and whereas in the medieval period uh, religion was a key focus of their life. Um, r religion gave us the seasons, it gave us the times when we could celebrate through feasts and banquets, it gave us the times when we gave to each other through Christmas and this kind of thing. So uh, um, religion, Christian religion, was huge within the, uh, the medieval world and therefore um, giving back to that religion I believe simply was an act of charity or an act of faith and an act of service that uh, many people would have felt. And many of the uh, Christians took their families or at least their wives on crusade um, and you, those stories can be quite well documented and at some point in the future we'll do some videos uh, around women in the Crusades and the, the roles that those people played which were very central to um, to the crusading uh, period. Alrighty guys, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and share. I'll catch you in my next video.